fuck first world problems. This is American problems. Only in America would our government not give a damn about us and put literal fucking registered child fucking rapist offenders from jail out to society to live next to fucking children in their neighborhoods, in their schools, by their own fucking schools. Only in America would fucking police officers ignore the many fucking reports of abuse in a child's home or, you know, someone's a rapist or something like that. They're like, we can't do anything. Yes, you fucking can. It's either you can or you won't and you don't want to because you guys are protecting these motherfuckers, which makes me feel like y'all are also the motherfucking predators as well, which doesn't surprise me because I've seen many fucking crooked cops that are not only fucking racist, but they are also rapists as well. (sighs) Only in fucking America. Fuck this country. Fuck this country. I, I am here for American slander. This is American slander only. I don't give a fuck if it's coming from an American or a foreign person. I don't care, bitch, because it's deserved. America deserves to be slandered. You cannot tell me that America does not deserve to be slandered. Let's see, it's based on pedophilia, Uh, sexism, racism, misogyny, homophobia, disrespect, protecting predators, protecting rapists, you know, motherfuckers in power just taking advantage, um, just all types of fucked up shit happening. We have to have fucking lockdown fucking shit in our schools because motherfuckers can't fucking ban guns because they act like Oh, we don't know what to do about the situation. Bitch, literally every fucking country that doesn't have a bunch of violence. You want to know why? It's because they don't have fucking guns. They don't allow psychopathic fucking people to buy guns. So yeah, yeah, America and Americans, particularly white ones, because honestly, uh, native people were already here first. Black people did not ask to be brought over here. Um... On the fucking ships, bitch. We were minding our own goddamn business. Our ancestors were minding their own goddamn business until they were brought over in this bitch. So yes, America deserves slander 100% forever and always. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk.